What's up, good people? Welcome to One Off Builds. Today I'm gonna show you this little apron we made. Just shop apron, nothing too serious. What's up, baby boy? What are you doing? Who are you talking to? Talking to the camera. Just recording for the channel. To get more subscribers. To get more subscribers. You got it. Yeah, yeah, but I know something. Every time you like do something like. Like, do a video or something, you used to get more subscribers. More subscribers. You got it. Hey, is that a That's my ace. Check me out. I'm starting with some old school NBA UNK basketball jeans. Little fray here, little fray right here, but overall, they're in pretty good shape. Just some patch pants that uh, UNK came out with maybe 10, 12, 15 years ago. I'm not quite sure, but they were in style at the time. Here, you'll see me cutting up one pant leg. The other pant leg I made a different style apron with, more of a full body apron, like for welding and things like that. So I just cut up the whole pant leg. Here you'll see me squaring off this side, and also trim the other side. Just wanted to make sure that both sides of the apron were fairly square to the top and the bottom. So I just trimmed them up as close as I could get them. Now I'll match up my previous apron, the old apron I made uh, against the pants, find a good spot to start cutting and give myself about a half inch around the entire apron the previous apron. There I'll be cutting the contour at the bottom, just a nice little curved contour, just so that the bottom wasn't straight. Give it a little bit of extra flair. Now we're gonna take that piece that we cut off at the bottom and use that as our, our pocket. We'll just pin the top of our pocket back and we'll throw a, just one stitch across the entire top of the pocket just to have it not be a rough edge. Here we'll find a good place to put our pocket. We'll pin it down and then we'll stitch all the way across the garment. Now we have that done. I'm gonna throw a stitch right in the middle and we'll line up the previous seams of the pant leg just so that it looks finished. Here we'll start pinning back the top of the apron all the way to the top, all the way to the middle of the apron. Here we're throwing in the stitch all the way to the top of the apron. Now on this side, this is the pocket, the left hand pocket of the pant leg. So when we cut the pants for our apron sizing, we cut that pocket. Now we'll just stitch down the side of the apron and in doing so we'll close that pocket up because we'll include that pocket with the stitch. Go ahead, stitch all the way down the left side of the apron, all the way till you get basically to the middle of the apron. Here we'll be pinning the middle of the apron to the bottom. And I'll show you here that I'm sewing from the bottom to the middle of the apron. Closing up that entire pocket on that side. So now we have one closed pocket. Now we'll pin the other side, pocket included. And we'll stitch. Here you'll see me 
pinning also the bottom of the apron. So after stitching the side and the bottom, we'll remove all the pins. Now we just need to add the grommet holes at the top in the middle of the apron. I chose some standard silver grommets, uh, something pretty simple. Use my old school grommet press. You can see how professional it looks. I don't know if you can tell here, but I'm using a wrench as my handle, but you know, that's a conversation for a different day. Here I'm just throwing some stitches into the top of the strapping. Got some nice hooks that I use for the top. Feed those through the grommet holes, the eyes that we made previously. Here we're just gonna make a little back strap holder. This is where the straps will cross in the back. It acts as a holder for the straps. Also allows you not to lose the shape of your apron each time you put it on and take it off. Straps are a little long, but I can cut those down to size later if necessary. Here I'll just feed the straps through each grommet, pull them all the way through. Little pencil at the top, add a little pin in, throw my knife in, and where we made our pocket earlier, perfect cell phone holder, just the essentials. Now it's time to try it on, check the fit. What do you guys think? Like the fit? That's it. Straps are a little long. We can throw the straps in the pockets. But that's it.